Welcome to Wigjig Video University. In this episode, we're going to go through how to make a figure eight connector and a modified figure eight connector. We use the modified figure eight connector in earrings to change the orientation of the way the earring hangs. And obviously we use the regular figure eight as a connector quite often to connect a chain to a clasp or connect components in a chain. We're going to start by making just a regular figure eight connector and we do that with a straight segment of wire and our round nose pliers and we're going to begin, we're going to make slightly larger figure eight connector than we normally would, but we begin by making a loop in the wire and we just want to push the wire up and over to make a regular P loop. And the P loop looks like that. Now the second loop we're going to make in the figure eight connector, we're going to make in the opposite direction. So we're going to grip the wire like that and we're going to push this wire up and over and the jaws of the plier are kind of in the way so we can't finish this as we'd like to. So we're going to reorient it like that and then we're going to pull the wire the rest of the way around to complete our figure eight. And so the figure eight looks like that. When it's removed from the pliers, it looks like that. Now we need to cut the figure eight connector. So we're going to use our flush cutter. And we orient our flush cutter with the flat side of the flush cutter towards the finish piece. So it's going to be oriented just like that. And we're just going to cut and that's our figure eight connector. In order to connect that figure eight connector to a chain, we use our bent chain nose pliers. And I'm going to open the loop by twisting it up like that. Connect the chain like that. And close the loop by twisting it in the opposite direction. And you can give it a squeeze with your chain nose pliers like that. But that's our figure eight connector and that's how we could make a figure eight connector and use it to connect a clasp to a chain or two components on a chain. The next thing we're gonna make is our modified figure eight connector. And with either the regular figure eight connector or the modified figure eight connector, I could use my step jaw pliers to make the initial loop in the figure eight, just make a loop like this. I need to reorient the wire like this so that I can complete the loop. And I have my regular P loop like that. Now I'm going to use my bent chain nose pliers to grab that loop. And then I'm going to bend this wire down so that it's perpendicular to that loop. Bend it down like that. So you can see that I have a right angle bend in the loop there. And now I need to make my second loop using my round nose pliers. I grab it with my round nose pliers. Push the wire up and over like that. Now I need to reorient the wire in my pliers so that I can complete the loop and I do that like that. And I finish the loop. Like that. Comes off my pliers looking like this. And I need to cut the excess wire with my flush cutter. Again, flat side of the flush cutter towards the finished piece. Got to cut it like that. And I have my modified figure eight connector. Now to connect it, I open it the same way. Twist open. Connect it to my chain or my ear wire. And twist close like that. And that's my modified figure eight connector. And it changes the orientation. If you were hanging an earring, it would change the orientation of an earring. 
So that's how we make a figure eight connector like this or a modified figure eight connector like that.